Aloha, you're probably expecting Pastor Joe, but I'm more handsome. <laughs> but as you all know, um, these are crazy times that we're in with this COVID-19. But we want to remind you that God is on the throne, that Jesus hasn't let us go, and there's no need to be afraid. God has not let us go. As a matter of fact, in Philippians 1, Paul writes this to the church at Philippi, being confident of this very thing, that he who has begun a good work in you will complete it until the day of Jesus Christ. So what we're trying to do at Calvary Door of Faith is to keep people connected with each other and with the word and with worship. So what we're trying to do here is we're gonna to start to video and put on YouTube uh, some worship sets and Pastor Joe's message until this craziness goes past us. The other thing is that we have folks from Alaska and far away who have often asked us for years to tape our worship and to tape our uh, messages so they can share far away. So God's actually provided this opportunity for us to share with the body of Christ throughout the world. Isn't that awesome? Amen. Amen. Also, I want to remind you that in this season, we don't want to have a spirit of fear. We want to have a spirit of hope and of joy because we know the Creator. We know the God who made all things. And we're told in Romans that all things work together for those, for good, for those who love God and we're called according to His purpose. Amen. And we and you are all called by God. So that means God's working things together for good for His purpose. Does this mean COVID-19 is good? No. Does it mean pneumonia and death is good? No. But it means that when we trust God, he can take even the craziest things and make them for good. Don't believe him? Think about the worst day in history, the day Jesus died on the cross. Can you think of a worse day than that? And yet God took his son and rose him from the dead in power so that we could have that power and we could live anew and our sins could be forgiven. We have new life because of the power of God in the most terrible day in the world. So we're going to begin to start. Now, Molokai Calvary, Dora Faith is our address. And you'll be able to see other messages and other worship. And um, we're going to pass it on to Pastor Joe in just a minute for a, um, a message. And you'll be able to see the worship. But this is just our, our, um, our normally, oh, and even though we're not going to be able to gather on Sundays, in big groups, we want to encourage people to still come to worship practice, to small groups, to Bible studies, and to meet together in groups of under 10. You can still share. We can still have fellowship. We can still pray. So, Kili Ho'omalu's Bible study is Wednesday nights um, at Kalapana Indiana's house. Worship practice is still here at Dorothy Church on, um, on Tuesday evenings. Uh, and if you're not in a small group or a Bible study, Call Pastor Joe, and we'll plug you into one, or we'll make one for you. So God bless you all. We love you. May our Calvary Dorothy family, and may the body of Christ be blessed. And may Jesus just pour all his blessings on us in this time that the world seems to be losing hope. We have his hope in Jesus' name. Amen.